In this tutorial, I will show you my workflow and how I create a gym bag or a duffel bag using Marvel's Designer and ZBrush. I'll start by creating a reference board and a couple of simple sketches, just so I can use them as a guide. Once I have those, I can start creating the main shapes inside of Marvelous, I'm using a couple of color guides just to help us understand all the parts that are going to uh, create the final bag. Once we have that done, we can start working on the hand straps and on the shoulder straps. Next, we'll move to the zipper and I'll be showing you how to create a zipper using the zipper tool inside of Marvelous. Next, we'll move on to creating the upper flaps and any other parts that uh, remain for our main body of the, of the gym bag. Once we have that ready, we'll move into ZBrush and we'll start creating the, the buckles. And then we can uh, bring the buckles back into, Z into Marvelous and start working on the uh, posing, the final bag in its final position for our hero shot. Once we're happy with the, uh, with the pose, we can start adding the final details like the stitching and uh, then prepare the model to be exported into, into ZBrush. In ZBrush, we'll start by creating a cleaner topology just to, to make our lives easier when we start adding details and stitching. And also, I'll be showing you how uh, I UV map my models before I start adding any small or tiny folds here and there. If we're happy with the details in ZBrush, we can prepare the model to be exported for rendering. I'll be using Adobe Dimension to render the final image. I have been using the Adobe Dimension for a while now, and I love using this tool because it's really simple, it's really easy to use, and the results that you that comes out of it is really fast for, and the, and the quality is really good for how much time you spend on each image. And it gives me the ability to create multiple shaders, multiple looks, without too much hassle. I really hope you find this tutorial helpful.